So here, let's review unpacking the teaks. Here I have an Algebra 1 teaks, that, uh, one of the SEs. So it says, write linear equations in two variables given a table of values, a graph, and a verbal description. Now, the first thing I do when I unpack my teaks is I circle, identify my verb, and I circle it. And the only verb I see here is write. The second thing that I do is I take my um, SE and I look for the actual concept. What are we talking about here? And I underline it. So in this case, we're talking about linear equations in two variables. So to me, that's important to know, to, to know what the student is expected to do through the verb and to know what you're talking about. For me, I have to make sure that I have parameters. You got to tell me what, because I, I can go all over the place with this. So the next part is the most important part to me. It's the contextual information. So I figure out what the contextual information is and I box it in. In this case, it's given a table of values, a graph, and a verbal description. So I need to focus only on those three aspects. If I'm going to te teach the teaks, I need to make sure that I don't go out of my lane and try to do some other stuff necessarily. I need to make sure that I'm hitting um, values in a table, graphs, and verbal description. Once I have done all three of those things where I identified and circled the verbs, I've underlined the, um, the concept, and I've boxed in my context, then I can take this SE and I can break it down into its smaller parts. Because I want to make sure that when I go and I develop my lesson that it covers all of the teaks. So in this case, I'm going to break it down into three parts. So there's only one verb. So the only thing that the students are expected to do, they're going to be tested is by writing. They have to write something. What are they writing? Linear equations of two variables. How does, do these linear equations of two variables need to uh, appear? As a, in a table form. How else? As a graph. How else? In a verbal description. So I have to make sure that when I design my lesson, that it covers writing linear equations of two variables, given a table of values, writing in linear equations in two variables, given a graph, and writing linear equations in two variables, given a verbal description. So they will, if I have a test question, the EOC test question, they may have a table where the student is going to have to write an equation from. They may have a graph. They extract information and write an equation from, or they may have a ver verbal description where the student is going to have to write linear equations in two variables. So I have to make sure that I address the entirety of the teaks. Otherwise, I have not taught the teaks in this entire thing. So that's some um, number five. It talks about framing the lesson. It has two things, a learning objective, and it has a closing product. Thank you.